was fast. We'll see. Oh, it's a catfish. Well, came out here to start the day and uh, caught a big old catfish. That's probably going to wind up being all that's in here. Channel cat. I know. All right. All right, first fish in quite a while, and it's a pretty decent sized channel cat. You know, they actually got a bit of a, kind of a pearlescence to them uh, when you hold them in direct sunlight like this. Quit biting me. I'm trying to help. All right, there we go. It's about a, about a two pound channel cat there. Figures it would be them here. You can see the water is still just terrible quality, but uh, it's finally starting to warm up, so there's some kind of bite going on at least. Not bad. Caught on a Charlie uh, crappy uh, jig, custom magic jig. <laughs> nice. This is really pretty. All right, uh, that spot was beautiful. So is this. Uh, we had to switch, obviously because saw a guy fishing here and he said he had some luck. So we're gonna give it a shot. It's a thunderstorm overhead, of course. Nasty one. Ah, it's getting awfully wet. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I just got a bite from a trout. I don't know if that came out on camera, but God, this is getting bad. I saw the fish. I'll bet, I'll bet you could see that on camera, too. Oh my God, I can't do it. Can't. Come on, let's head back before we get completely soaked. Oh my God, five seconds and I'm getting soaked. About ready to strangle a man to death. All right, so we're here at Flat Swamp today. A little different spot than our usual spot, which is over there most of the time, uh, just because everybody and their brother decided to come out and do this today. And we're just gonna be bobber fishing with worms. Um, I'm using my phone because I've got a bunch of footage on my GoPro and I've been too lazy to take it all off. Uh, too lazy to make videos recently, really. Um, just uh, really, uh, new job taking up a lot of my time um, but uh, summertime should see more consistent videos coming out uh, now that we got more lighted hours of the day so kick back with us we're just gonna be sitting down and enjoying the water welcome back to the fish dimension all right so there we go nice size bluegill and uh, as you can see there they're getting that orange breast back so their winter colors are finally going away and they're getting their summer pattern back nice to see them I really gotta find some way to just uh, okay another bluegill nice little guy very nice very nice First two casts and we got a video already. All right, so here's uh, oh boy, here's my little guy. You can see that orange breast coming back. Yeah, looking very pretty. Yep, yeah. let's get him, get him back in the water. If it just takes off, then you're, then you're usually good to go. Like that. Like that. Nice. Not bad, not bad. In the mouth and they are definitely getting their, their summer colors back. 
All right, there we go. Beautiful. Nice little guy. Beautiful. Oh, you do they, it. they love to flop out of your hands. Yeah. All right, well, in, in true form, not catching it on the, the fight on camera, uh, my baby caught a crappie here. And they uh, they should be in this general area and everything, but they don't usually bite worms, so that's uh, a bit more rare of a daytime catch on a worm. Yeah, nice little crappie. Yeah, good to, good to have a crappie in the video. Of course, they've been in our last, like, ten videos. <laughs> that's all we catch most of the time. Yep. That's what we go for specifically. Uh -huh. He's a decent sized one too. Yeah, not bad. Well, all these fish are lucky we're not eating today. Mm -hmm. He was right up on the bank. Mm. Got you a shell crab. So we definitely got a multi-species day going here. Boy, he's shuddering. <laughs> they do. All right, this, it's hard to tell because they look so much like bluegill when they're this small, but that's a little shell cracker. You can see the orange uh, right here. Yeah, so that's a little shell cracker. So that's good because uh, what we came here to do was get on those big shell cracker that we have in that video that it is like blowing up like crazy it's up to like 19,000 views now it's like 22,000 yeah that's like <laughs> that's that's like late years above any other video I've done I don't know why it's getting that much attention but so shell cracker maybe maybe we'll get those big ones today I hope so I'd love to get on some of them mm -hmm. okay, there's another nice little uh, bluegill for you and I drop my rod uh, yeah, so uh, we kept fishing for a while and uh, you really saw the best part of the day because once it got hit midday the fish uh, started taking their, their midday break I guess and the bite die, died entirely. So uh, this is the, the first one I've caught in, uh, in an hour or two and he's, uh, he's actually still got his winter colors. He doesn't have his, uh, his breast coming in quite yet but uh, there you go. Another nice little bluegill there. It's one of the more sizable ones we caught today but uh you know it looks like things are pretty slow and we're not staying till evening because game of thrones so uh we'll just say uh thanks for stopping by the fish dimen dimension and uh look for more videos coming soon but uh you know been taking a bit of a hiatus here lately mm -hmm. the racket begins <laughs>